welcome to Biology. guys so you want to know why i have been mia well i decided that i really needed to follow the doctor's rules and stay on bed rest so i stayed on bed rest for three days um i have been feeling much better and why i was on bed rest guys i came across two YouTubers and one of them I have already called my sister and I will give you the link right here and what her picture is her name is treasure sitting pretty her name is Jasmine so she has became my Georgia sister okay the other person guys oh my gosh I literally set my alarm for this person. Today is Thursday and I set my alarm so I don't miss her live. Her YouTube channel, which I will put right here, is Carter's Eat. Her name is Miss Lisa. Guys, on yesterday, Wednesday, and don't get me wrong with the date, I will insert the date down here. I can't remember dates right now. Um, she filled me up so much. I'm driving and trying to hold back tears. My Lord, it, I, I will say it this way, guys. If you have not linked into the YouTuber, Carter's Eat. Hunty. Mm. You missing a gospel treat. Guys, on yesterday, for the last four days, I have been so full with so much stuff in me and on last Saturday, Sunday, um, see, I'm just full of tears. Um, last Saturday, I was just going through a rough day. And if you remember something that you probably heard your grandparents say or your grandmother is to go pray in the closet. I got out of my bed and I went in my big closet and I sat on the floor and I prayed. As I was praying, my phone rang. It was my blessed mom. She adopted me about two and a half years ago. And you know, guys, I love going to Goodwill. So in Columbia, South Carolina, when I was living there, um, I went in there one morning, she stopped me at the door and she was like, good morning, I am the queen, I'm Miss Universe. And I was just like, oh my God, who is this lady? So um, from that day, I have went inside her home and did home interior decorating. Um, guys, when you don't have your mom and it's somebody that comes down and touch you in a way, oh, um, that's my mom. I call it my mom. I call it that. My kids call it that. My husband knows when I say, oh, that's my mom calling. He knows who it is. With her, I got a papa, and I also have a brother, Preston. So, guys, um, oh, a sister law and, and more nieces and nephews also, and they're in California. But yesterday with Miss Lisa, with her talking and me going through so much for the last three years and i can really say for the last nine years because i lost my mom on mother's day 2011. yesterday miss lisa opened up a box in me 
that needed to be really released. Um, after surgery, a lot of you I have not updated you all yet. I went through three infections. That's why I'm on bed rest. I'm out now because I'm feeling good and I got the thumbs up that I can go out and move around a little bit and then come back in and rest. Um, guys, oh gosh. Tears in your eyes and trying to drink, drive and sunshine. Mm. But let me get to my point. Yesterday, Miss Lisa opens, she always opened up her lives with a scripture, then a prayer. Then we have your sermon. It's just open. She asks what's going on with everybody. She's always loving and concerned. She has two children and a husband, and her parents are staying with her. And only not just that, she's my, I grew up in South Carolina, and she is in my neighbor state. She's in North Carolina. But as we were talking, I was the spotlight of the day on yesterday with my channel, with her. And as we were going, I started telling, I started talking to everybody in the live. Guys, Miss Lisa just, she just have no clue how yesterday, she just gave me food for my entire soul. Besides that, I actually got up, took a shower, put on makeup, everything. Of course, wig girl. And I actually got out. It was just like yesterday was a day of just full love. Guys, I can't tell you how my day went yesterday. It's always someone that is there to steal your joy. But on yesterday, Miss Lisa spoke about that, people stealing your joy. And I'm telling you, my joy was taken away from me. Also, my joy was stomped on. Also, it was glued in a spot that could not be removed. But listen to Miss Lisa on yesterday, guys. It just released. And with that release, it came all my tears. I got today, had to DM Miss Lisa. Um, it's just like when someone gives you something and it is in your heart and you feel it. As we were doing life, her tripod kept falling. Guys, that is the reason why I'm out right now. Because I am out to get Miss Lisa a tripod and to mail it to her to tell her thank you. the end, I've never ever have said this, but one of the gospel songs that sits so close and dear to my heart is Tamara Man, Take Me to the King. I wake up every morning, guys, and I listen to that song. It is something about that song. yesterday Miss Lisa sang that for me <sighs> guys I'll be right back okay guys I'm back had to get me back together um what I want to say Miss Lisa nothing but the Holy Spirit that brought me to your life and I thank Treasure 
Jasmine because she shared it out. And I was laying there and I wasn't even on my phone and I click it and right when I clicked my phone, it came across and it said YouTube. So I went ahead on and click it and it was way treasure shared it. That's God. A lot of people don't believe in that, but that's God. Today, I not too long ago got off live. Her live went on at 11.13. It is currently 1.31. So I think Miss Lisa been off now for about 10 minutes. I was on that live the whole entire time, guys. I'm going to miss Miss Lisa so much. But I can always catch Miss Lisa and look at the live once I go back to work, I can always go back and look at her life. Um, it's only probably one or two people that's on my YouTube know what I go through. And that would be Simply Monique and that would be um, Fabulous Designs by On A Budget. Those two girls I talk to often. Um, two ladies, sorry, ladies. But um, trying to get my thoughts ready. And since I did not do my tablescape Tuesday, I, I was trying to be in my resting period. Honestly, guys, I was just trying to follow doctor's orders and do what I'm supposed to do so I can get myself back up and start moving. And I know he explained to me, you can't heal if you on the go all the time. I'm OCD with my home. I, my home has to be clean. The reason why I'm out right now, because my son was like, mama, we're out of dishwasher pods. So I, he was like, I will go get them. And I was like, no, it'll give me a, a few minutes just to go out to get a little bit of fresh air. So, um, I'm out headed to the Christmas tree now because I love going to get there because the bag is $11 and in the grocery store and Walmart, they're $16 and $17. So, that's where I'm headed. And it's not that far from my home. Um, I have some projects that I am going to record. I'm going to record two of them today. One of them is a Z Gallery hack, um, redo DIY. Um, I'm so ready to reveal my living room, guys. And when you order things from offline, it can be sometimes the worst. I order my curtains. I order them, well, the first time I order them through a different person and I canceled the order and I got my money back. So I went on eBay and I found curtains that and I wanted them 180, 108 inches long. So I found them, order them, pay for an order them and on yesterday I received them. Well why when I click the color you gonna send me a whole nother color that won't work. So, I had to go and contact them and let them know, hey, I did not order blue curtains. I did not have order blue curtains. I have many blue curtains, so why would I order more? So, they was like, oh, we're so sorry. We're going to send you the right one. It was a mistake. Okay, fine. So, um, it, he said, well, the person told me that it will probably be about three or four days before I receive it. So that still put me on hold to do my living room reveal for the fall. So my goal was to have it up September the 22nd, but the, what I'm, you know what? Because I'm working on my Z Gallery DIY, what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna go through 
and actually do my reveal to my living room. But I'm gonna let you know my curtains are not gonna be up. And once I receive my curtains, then I'll let you know who the, um, the company is, what I think, the, the total review on it. So um, I would do that because I, I have that on hold. Um, what else is coming up is also, guys, since I didn't do Tablescape Tuesday, I am going to do what the things that you can put on your dining room table to just it up. So, that is coming up. I have two new YouTubers and they have requests. One of them has requests DIYs for Christmas. The other one asked me to do some DIYs for a little girl's room. And of course, you know, I have a daughter. Next week, she'll be 16. But of course, I have been through all of that designing for a little girl. Got two boys, but I got that girl. So, I am going to do their request. And um, I'm not sure how I'm going to do the little girl <clears throat> part of it. Excuse me. But I might, I have asked her what is the theme to the bedroom because I want to make sure that it is built on the theme. And I want to do probably one or two DIYs that would be probably one under $10 and the other one probably be under $5. So I'm going to do that and most likely I will mail it to her. So she will have those two, two or three items for her daughter's room. Also, guys, I did not forget the giveaway. I did not forget it. I do have to record and upload that. Um, I am, I have that on, I'm looking up on it because I'm going around a curve in a truck by me. I'm sorry. Um, <clears throat> I do have that on my notes that I was supposed to do that on last Friday. But guys, I really was trying to get that bed rest in there. I really, really was trying to do that. And I got a lot of names that I have to put into that wheel. So, what I think I'm going to do is, because I think it's like 30 or 40, it may be 60 something, I think. I, I haven't looked, um, I insert down below how many people that is on that comment on the video so um i need to do that so in between today thursday and sunday because i have not been to church in three sundays because recovery bed rest and all so sunday guys i gotta go to church i just got to I miss my pastor so much. So, and I got to call him today because my husband went to church Sunday and he told me that Reverend David said I need to give him a call. And matter of fact, I'm not far from the church now, but I have on pants. And that's the only reason why I will not go to the church because I do not walk in the house of the Lord in pants. That's just me. That's how I grew up. So I don't go into church and I have on pants. I must have on a dress, a skirt. So I will not go to the church. Although today is Thursday, I have on pants. So that won't happen. Um, oh gosh, I'm in the road. I'm sorry. What I may do, I'm getting ready to go on the Christmas tree. So I may um, give y'all a little sneak peek of what's in the Christmas tree here. Um, and I'm over in Augusta, Georgia, because that's like 30 something, about 25, 30 minutes for me. And I'm in the wrong lane and these people are turning. Oh my gosh. Can I go over? Yes. Because I'm getting held up in traffic. Okay. Now I want to get past that traffic. So I first of all got to go to the bank to the bank first and then I am going to take y'all into the Christmas tree with me I 
I really want to go to at homes because it's right behind me and I can go back this way to go back home um because there's one place in a town called Grove Town that I want to go to so um just keep watching because I'm gonna take y'all into the Christmas tree with me okay hi guys I know I said I was coming back and do a shop with me while I was in the store but I ended up talking to the manager for so long I did not come back on camera but guys I have lots of new videos coming so stay tuned hey.